So this is the fifth one I got the other day, and I said I'd eventually take a look at the tape decks. Well, these 90s decks use an idler wheel to drive the take-up spool, and if that goes, it don't matter if you got replacement belts for the cap stand and pulley, it still won't play a tape. Well, it will. It'll guide it through the pinch roller, but there won't be any take-up, so it's going to get chewed up. So... I finally got into it and I put it back together the best I could do. So let's see here. This might be a little bit hard. So I can't jam my big phone in here. Where is it? I can't even find where it is. Underneath that. Okay, so it's it's that little white wheel underneath the bigger white wheel. That's the uh idler wheel. That's what drives that, which is the main cap stand. No, yeah, no, not main cap stand, sorry. Take up spool. It's the main take up spool. And I did replace all the other belts, but when I did it the first time, I didn't notice that little wheel, like the take up spool wheel, which is, you can't even see it. Um, that's why I didn't even see it last time, so and it didn't still didn't play a tape, but now it's enough torque to get it to t get the take up spool not the best, but that's all, literally all I can do. And I try to tape, and it seems to take up the slack just fine. Wow, and flutter is still a little eh, but at least I got it working now. It's better than having it not working at all. I don't even know if that crap is going to get me copyright. It's a stupid cassette. I don't know where it came from. Joplin's. I'm not into that. <laughs> so. I'm not dealing with deck A. I don't have anything I can do to uh, get that one going. But I dealt with this one because this is the record side. And I'm curious. I wanted to have a recorder on this boombox. So that's why I dealt with B side. But that's basically that. And uh. Taking it apart is not that bad. So, anyway, that is what I dealt with for the last couple hours, trying to find a solution. Again, it's that wheel right there. The little white one with the rubber on it. Yep, without that rubber, there's no uh, grip to turn that which is the take-up spool. That's why I'm not too fond of the players from the 90s. A lot of them are like that. But anyway, I'm going to put the boombox back together and call it a day.